in meetings, but I've been to a few. Anything that's of great importance, I do feel we have pretty good boards who know what they're doing, and I trust their judgment. So as far as community involvement, I've had quite a bit. Did you mean, uh, what did you mean by before running? Before you submitted your petition to run, <coughs> what committees were you involved in? How were you involved in the town prior? I lived in the town prior. I've lived here most of my life. As for volunteering, if you can consider helping out your neighbors volunteer work, I don't consider it because I think that my parents raised me that that's just what you do. If you can help someone in need, you help someone in need. If you want to call that volunteer work, you can call that volunteer work. But I've lived here all my life. I know a lot of the people here. I help them personally. And so I guess that's my volunteer work. I was not on any committees before running for election. I have served uh, as a little league coach. I helped start the Dyke Youth Basketball Program. Uh, I was on committees at the high school, not because I worked there. Well, partially because I worked there. I worked. I was on the school council for not the school committee, the school council for about 35 years. I've gone to most town meetings I go to. Do I go to special meetings that are involved? No. But I don't think that necessarily makes me a good person or a bad person. I, my, what makes me want to do this is the fact that I'm retired. I love this community. I was, uh, my kids have been brought up in this community. Uh, and I think I've done a lot for the community with my profession. Helping staff up with the new programs. Um, prior to running this time, uh, when I retired, um, I uh, applied for appointment to the Finance Committee and was appointed. Uh, about that time was a few years after that. That's when the first announcement came about the Berkeley Dighton Bridge. And I went to that board of selectmen and said, I would love to volunteer to be a liaison for this board for that project because I feel strongly about it and I want to see it done. I was appointed. Then I was elected. Um, volunteer work, I'm very active in my church. I do a lot of fundraising. Uh, in the town, I was the ADA officer. I was on the soil board. Uh, I was the EEO officer. Um, the, uh, I volunteered. Uh, as a member of the Finance Committee, it was appointed by Mass Municipal Association for the Policy Committee on Energy and the Environment. I still serve. When I was not re-elected, that board of selectmen wrote a letter to MMA, to the president of MMA, and asked that I might be reappointed because of the value of that experience brought to the town and what we were able to do with that. I would like to thank everyone in this room for coming tonight. Um, I think it was a lively discussion. We got to know our candidates more. Um, so thank you to the audience. Thank you for your questions. Thank you to the candidates for taking the time to be here. It was most informative and helpful, I'm sure. Remember to vote on September 26th. That's the special election. And um, we'll see you next year. <laughs>